okay, I'm starting. We're starting. Okay. Uh, my book reports about I Am Legend by uh, Richard Matheson. It's about a man named uh, Big George. Uh, it's about a man named Robert Neville, the last man on earth against a horde of uh, vampires. See, they're vampires. I read the book. Uh, okay. Um, uh, do you have a video? Can you be ready to share with me? Starts off. Uh, um, oh yeah, the power play rate. <laughs> um, well yeah, that's I Am Legend, so I just put my own. Uh, I put this one, Nosferatu, mm -hmm. and it represents all the vampires in the story. Yes. And, I don't know, I, I like the picture, that's fine. That's pretty much it. Yeah. The next picture. A man jumping from one cliff to another, which mm -hmm. uh, represents risk taking, because uh, Neville had to. Oh, thanks. It represents uh, Neville because he um, had to go through all these, these vampires and to get supplies and stuff during night, and how dangerous it was for him. This one, this picture, represents. Represents uh, the apocalypse, uh, how it like ruins his life, and how the whole set, like how empty his life was in the city and town. All over the town. Um, this one represents one man against, I guess, the world. And because um, Nev, it was just Neville against all these zombies, and well, yeah. All these zombies uh, by himself, he had to fight. He had to fight them off and stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, not You're zombies. Did I say zombies? Vampires. Sorry. It's okay, bro. Right. Uh, this one, um, this one represents uh, Neville's insanity because during the whole story, he was believing that he was one of them and he wasn't human no more. You know? He didn't think he was. He didn't believe yeah. that he was alive anywhere. I like yeah. that. I like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah you know okay. what I mean. But um, it'll be saved. That's it for this. <laughs> um, this this looks pretty good for uh, what do you want me? That's the last one. No, wait. What? Sure, sure. You should just put it. Side. Yeah, shit, but do it. Um, okay. well, this this put uh, this looks pretty good. It's, it's really good. It's really good. It, it's nothing like the movie. This one's a lot better. Um, the setting for this book, there's really no setting except Cinnamon Street. That's pretty much it. There's no other place. Um, all this character that, that would be in the story would be the dog. It has no name. He just finds it in the in the town while like trying to survive. Um, another one would be the oh chomp. <laughs> Thanks, thanks for ruining it. This is a grade. <laughs> this is a grade. Thank you. All right, so you're done. Um, I don't know what else. That's that's all, folks. That's all, folks.